What's going on guys? It is your boy Havoc here. Welcome to yet another tutorial on the channel. Today I will be showing you guys how to make an intro for your YouTube videos for free using Panzoid. If this video does help you out, a like will be very much appreciated. Let's go for 200 likes. And also if you could, be sure to subscribe for future tutorials and just various videos on the channel. And if you guys have any like future tutorials or videos that you would like me to cover, just let me know down in the comments and I will be sure to look through those. And with that being said, let's get straight into the video. Alright, so the first thing that you're going to want to do is click on the first link in the description and that will take you to this page right here. And uh, here we've got multiple different uh, intro templates. So you've got a section called popular and then a section called newest. So I would go ahead and click on show more for the popular ones because those typically are higher quality. I mean, it makes sense. Um, but like I said, you've got a lot of different templates to choose from. So don't choose something if you don't truly like it. I would just scroll through these pages, try to look for something that you like. Um, for instance, for me, my channel brand is more kind of blue based. So I really think this one looks good. So I'm going to go ahead and click on it. And then once you find something, just open in Clip Maker. And that'll take you to this page right here. And to start out, I would suggest just trying to preview it. Just just to see what the intro looks like so click on this eyeball icon right here and click on the play button and that basically shows you a, a uh, just a render kind of preview of what the intro will look like obviously we won't have the name right here we'll have our channel name and I'll show you guys in a second how to change that alright so after that what you're gonna want to do is click on this check mark right here which is the basics and We've got the resolution, frame rate, and the length. So this is just basic settings that you could possibly change for the intro. So let's say you upload videos at 1080p quality. So you obviously want your intro to be the same quality. Um, but let's say you also, maybe you upload videos at 720. So just click whatever kind of quality video you do. Just remember the higher the quality, the longer the render time will be. I would not go below 720p though, uh, however, because the quality will be pretty bad if you do that. Um, but since I upload at 1080p, I will just go ahead and click that. Here's the frame rate. We've got 30 and 60. I myself don't really think it matters that much uh, for the quality, so just click on 30. And for the length, I would not go above 10 seconds because who really wants to sit around and watch a 20 second intro? So after you're done with that, go ahead and click this cube icon, which is objects. And this is where we're gonna change the text. So as you can see, for some of the intro templates, uh, they'll have the text kind of shown up here. But for this one, you have to scroll a little bit down. So just click on it. And then we're gonna change it to our channel name, which is the Havoc in all caps. There we are right there. Now make sure you do this on both of the fonts. This font is kind of, I guess, has two layers to it. So you have another text down here and make sure you change that to the same exact lettering, your channel name, which is the Havoc as well. And there we are right there. Now let's say for some of these intros, and I've, I found quite a few of these intros where the text is way too big. Uh, I mean, it's the right size for the original um, lettering that they put on here, which is just name, but your channel name might be really long so by the time you put that on there it might be too big and it might be chopping out some parts so to change the change the size of this we can change the height to like 10 and then you also have to make sure you change it on the other font as well and there you are see you can change the size of the font but let's say you want to keep it the same so we're going to go back to 25. now as you can see the text it's kind of pretty it's pretty bland um, now for some of these intros you can keep it the same um, but I kind of want to I, I kind of want to tell you guys something that you can do you can actually change the texture so if you google like blue textures or whatever color the intro is uh, cool textures and just pick a picture on Google you can actually upload that onto here now obviously you can't really see anything right now and that's because we haven't uploaded it onto the other layer of font so once we upload that see so let's say you don't like this though and we can preview this right here it's a little dark right here right 
So what you can do is you can change the color up here instead of blue like let's make it white click choose and then you can do that on this other one as well so you can go ahead and choose white as well so now let's preview it I think that looks a lot cooler than the original text don't you guys think I think that looks pretty dope right there so that looks pretty good um so the next thing that I also want to tell you guys quickly is that you can change the music now every single intro has built-in music in it so i mean there it's usually uh in sync with the intro so you usually don't really need to change anything but let's say you really like the intro but you don't like the song you can change the song to something that you want instead so you can pick a song from youtube or whatever um and if you have it downloaded onto your computer you can go to audio file select and you can select it uh, I don't have any music right here but your files will show up right here and you can go ahead and open them on here and that way you can change the songs to whatever you want um, but usually I like the songs uh, that the creators choose now after you're done with that let's say your intro is all complete and you don't want to change anything else just click this download button and right here we can choose the mode so if you want your intro to be very good quality, which obviously will slow down the render time, you can do that. But I would suggest either balanced or good quality. I wouldn't go extreme quality or faster render. Um, I would go either one. We're just going to click on balanced. And then the format, you can choose MKV or WebM. I'm going to choose WebM. And then you start video render. And that's all you really have to do so after it's finished rendering you can go ahead and either click on download your video or you can return to editing so go ahead and click download and then your your video will start downloading down here so we can go ahead and open it and just to see what it looks like and there's the intro that we made it looks pretty good um, but let's say you want like a higher quality or you want to change some of the some of the settings um, after you do this you can always go to uh, go back to editing and you can just change some of these some of these different things so let's say you want higher or a better quality render so you can easily change that and then do another render um, but like like I said it's just trial and, and error and basically just choose what looks best and try to try to get the best intro that you can but like I said you've got like 2,000 different templates to choose from so you've got plenty of things to pick from so don't choose something if you don't truly like it Choose something that that you really like because you have you have lots of options and with that being said I hope you guys did enjoy this tutorial I hope it helped you out if it didn't uh, let me know down in the comments just if, if you need any help just let me know and I'll try to help you out um, but be sure to leave a like if this did help you out and be sure to subscribe for future tutorials also be sure to comment some future tutorials that you would like me to do and with that being said it's been your boy havoc here and i'm out peace